going? What's going on, y'all? Just popped outside of uh, Key Biscayne, picked up a few nice live baits. A little small today, but we're gonna do our best. We're in like uh, 80 feet of water. We have a really weird drift right now. I think there's a probably a tide change right now. We're going like southwest, so we're just trying to hit whatever wrecks we're close by. Nice long leader, like always, for the bottom. Eight ounce of lead. You can either use a three-way swivel or a little pass-through swivel, whatever you guys like to use. Anything to get your lead on the bottom and your bait far back from it. Got the wife with me today. I know she's gonna show me up, so don't give me too much shit about it. Let's see what we come up with. We just came over our first wreck. We're on the west side of it now. Hopefully I'll get smacked here. I just dropped my bait back down. Whenever you approach a wreck, you wanna come up a few turns, make sure you're gonna clear it. If not, you're just gonna get stuck as you drift past it. So I brought it up, we just saw that we came off the back end of it, so I let it back down about 15, 20 feet, hit the bottom, cranked it up like once or twice. Coles hooked up, 180 feet. Came out a little deeper because the bite was kind of weird and short. A lot of small yellow tails and stuff. Number two! Damn, Nicole dropped down a bait after she brought up that mutton. She's hooked up again. Nicole is hooked up again. Caught that 20 inch mutton. She put a bait down. I still had mine down. I might not even have a bait because she put her bait down and got whacked right on the other side of that wreck. Let's see what we got here. There you go, boo. Sharks, show them up, Cole. That's all right. You gotta pay those taxes. This ain't no free ride. All right, just came back out to a buck 80. We're gonna hit this wreck again because Nicole picked up two muttons. One got uh, cooted by the boat. Let's see if we can hit the same drift and uh, pick something up. Weather is kind of getting nasty. If you look to the north, it's really nice. And as you scope out to the east and to the south, there's some pretty nasty storms out there. Radar shows them staying offshore, but we're gonna just keep an eye on it to stay safe. Worst case scenario, we'll just run back into the west and uh, dodge it. All right, here's where you got hit, so.
it's picked up pretty nasty so uh we're just gonna take this drift in finish this drift off heading west and probably just stay closer to shore until this uh, storm kind of passes through once it passes through it should be a pretty nice day for the rest of the day or so says the weatherman All right guys, so it got a little nasty out there. We decided to come back into Key Biscayne, Crandon Park real quick. And the radar shows that after around 11 o'clock, 12, it should be, you know, a pretty decent day. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, just grab some lunch and kick back, relax. We caught three muttons so far. Two of them got cut in half, unfortunately. So we only got one in the box, but I got a bunch of live bait still. Hopefully we'll be able to get tight. Stay tuned. Decided to come out to 200 real quick before we head in. Check that out. 